Hi, I'm Kim Ho. In this series, we'll be talking to people who have interesting, inspiring, or intriguing stories to tell. This week, we meet Shagupta Anurak. Shagupta rented a tiny 200 square feet office in Haji Lane to start her design practice. Today, Space Matrix is a global design firm with offices in 15 cities across eight countries. She did not stop there. She co-founded a design platform called Lipspace and in 2017 started a workplace management platform called Saltmine, which this year raised $27 million in Series A funding. This is her story. Whatever you do in your life, you do with integrity so that, you know, you're building um, a robust foundation which you can enjoy rather than trying to take shortcuts in life. And my dad sort of really shaped who I am as an individual, giving me the confidence, um, helping me to build my personality. Uh, and my mom on the other side was really the driving force towards my sort of studies and making sure that I focused on, you know, learning how to cook, learning how to sew, learning how to be good at everything that is needed from a life skills perspective. And my dad was really the foundation of my um, value systems and building my confidence to who I am today. My then boss, who was from London, left in six months because he couldn't survive in India. And I was left with this company where my boss said, okay, you, you run it. I was 22 years old. And I think that was my first sort of uh, journey into realizing what it is to build a company, what it is to run a company. And it was all through trial and error. It was all through experimentation. And I think that's basically one of the best ways to learn is on the ground, on the real field. So I had learned how to be an entrepreneur in the toughest of situations, but it was a really uh, exciting four years journey. One of my customers who I did work for in my previous company recommended me to this company. And I finally got a job, but I was the bottom of the pyramid. <laughs> so it was really interesting to, you know, come from, you know, growing all the way to running an organization and back towards the bottom of the organization. So I think it was a really interesting learning perspective to see how it feels when you're at the bottom of the equation. And I think that built a lot of empathy for me going forward within uh, my companies to know that how every individual in the organization actually feels. I really believe scarcity drives clarity and when you have limited resources, you get creative and innovative about it. And I think that's what we got because we just had $5,000. We got innovative. We went and took an office in Haji Lane. I saw an opportunity based on my skill set and the problems that I saw that customers were facing. Most of the design companies during those days were actually looking at um, design more like decoration, like purple carpet, yellow ceiling. But I realized that you could solve it in a business-oriented way. All of our enterprise customer, like every other vertical within their solutions has moved to the cloud, like HR has moved to the cloud, finance has moved to the cloud, uh, CRM moved to the cloud for Salesforce, but real estate and workplace is the second largest expense on their balance sheet, impacting their first largest expense, but it's still run out of PDF, broken solutions. So what we do is we build an enterprise level platform 
take all of their data to the cloud and build applications for them to help their workplace serve their people better. Women have phenomenal strength. They have phenomenal capabilities. They have amazing ability to focus. They have amazing ability to multitask. And my advice to them is just believe in yourself. That's the most important thing because that's what my dad gave me that belief when I was very young that you can do anything. You can. Do. He used to tell me you can do it better than guys. Whatever guys can do, you can do better. So I think if they get that level of support and confidence while they are growing, they will be able to conquer anything they want going forward.